guys, Kristen A here from Car3 TV with another update on the 2009 World Series of Poker. Two more bracelets have been awarded and one went to the winner of event number 24, the $1,500 buy-in in the Nolan Hold'em event, and Pete the Greek Volandos walked away with a first place prize of $607,000. Here's what he had to say at the bracelet ceremony. First of all, Pete, congratulations. Now, you won a bracelet in 1995, now in 2009, how did they compare? Well, the competition, like I said, it was easier in 1995 than it is today. It's larger field, and people the, in the internet, they know a lot more things uh, that they used to know the time that we used to play poker in 1995. But uh, I went through, uh, I enjoyed it very much, I played very hard, I was focused always, I knew exactly what I was doing and how I'm going to play a hand. I got lucky. What kind of changes have you had to make since then till now with the new influx of educated players? Well, I follow the players they play in the internet and I follow, you know, all those things that's happening late in the last 10, 15 years in the, in the poker world with the internet. So everything a little bit changed. Who is your toughest opponent at the final table? Uh, the fellow the, I played it head up, it was very tough, mm -hmm. very good player very world-class player. Well, you've, playing, you've been playing poker for more than a decade. Can you see yourself still playing in 10 more years, maybe with another bracelet win? Oh, I'll be playing a lot more than 10 years. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I will. All right. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank you. And the winner of Event 25, the $2,500 buy-in, half seven-card stud, eight or better, half Omaha, eight or better tournament is Phil Ivey. This is his second bracelet in 2009 and his seventh overall. He was awarded $220,000 for this win. There are two final tables playing out today. One is for the $1,500 buy-in Limit Hold'em event and the $5,000 buy-in Omaha 8 or Better event in which Scott Clements is currently the chip leader. And the two events continuing today are a $1,500 buy-in No Limit Hold'em event and the $10,000 buy-in World Championship Heads Up event. Be sure to stay tuned to CarPlayer.com's live updates. I'm Christina for CarPlayer TV.